Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So round two of that pick one of three champion arena is over. In that arena, you could choose between Nova, Howard the Duck, or Crossbones. I have all three of them and they're awakened, so I only went for milestones, but we'll take a look at the leaderboards and see if we see any names we recognize. Uh, the basic champion was uh, Red Hulk. All right, so... As you can see, the Jabari Panther arena is on right now, and I'm going for the four star. Uh, and this is where I'm at right now. I already did the T1 Alpha, haven't touched any of the others. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the compu uh, completed arenas. And here we go, milestones, uh, milestones. Got my 5,000 uh, and 300 six star shards, which I want. Uh, we're going to be able to open up a second six star uh, a little bit later today. All right, let's start from left to right. The uh, four star feature, as you see, I stopped right after I got the four million, which is the uh, top milestone. It's all I want to do in that arena. All right, let's take a look and see. I'm sorry that it, this is so late. Uh, I'm really behind right now. Uh, I'm doing all of this this morning. Normally, I had this video uh, completed shortly after the arena ends. Gray Wolf, congratulations. Um, but I had a headache yesterday, uh, and I was busy doing all kind of other stuff. And uh, I actually went to sleep and forgot all about making this video. So this morning, I didn't have my war video which you guys have already seen, hopefully, but I just finished making that one and publishing it. Now I'm making this one and I'll publish this one. Then I'm gonna do another video where I'm opening up two six stars and uh, the season rewards uh, opening. So uh, busy, busy, busy. Haven't even eaten my breakfast yet, uh, but I wanted to get this done so that I didn't have to worry about it. Uh, over this weekend, I'm not sure if I'm planning to do Variant 7, uh, mainly because I still have the event quest to do. So every time I have any energy, I'm doing a path in the uh, event quest. Cavalier is already done, uh, fully explored, and uh, Master, almost done. I have the final quest of the final chapter to explore, and then Master is done. Have not touched uh, Uncollected yet, but I will do that, uh, and we're gonna fully explore Uncollected as well. Now, there's a level up that's going to be coming up after this next event that we have right here, and I got some choices to make. Who am I gonna rank up? So I wanted to definitely get the um, six stars opened before the level up so that, you know, if I do get somebody that I want to rank up during that uh, opening, then I would have them ready. And if I don't, then it doesn't matter. Just want to be prepared. All right. Apologies if I saw your name but missed it because I'm trying to go pretty quickly, trying to get as much done as possible here. Um, here's the basic one here. Uh, he is still a useful champion, especially if you're a progressing player. Uh, he can help you in the variants. I actually used him in uh, the earlier variants. And Kabam has already stated that there will be content where you can only use your four stars or where your four stars have a severe advantage. Now, in uh, one of the previous variants, and I never remember which variant is which, um, but in one of the previous variants, you had different quests and you were limited. They had a restriction on the rarity. Uh, it was the first time Kabam had done that. And I, I admit I was evil and I laughed because a lot of people sold their champions. Uh, by the way, upcoming uh, update. You're not going to be able to sell your champions uh, anymore, um, but it was never a good idea. 
people would do it sometimes to get like an extra, you know, get some more shards so they can roll another uh, crystal or something like that. But it was never a good idea. And so you have a lot of end game players that didn't have any one stars or two stars. And when you got down to the last quest, you could only use one star champions. They couldn't do it. They didn't have any. Um, and then you had, you know, ones that you could only use your two stars. You know, they may have had the two stars. So, yeah, I, I kind of like that. I like that a lot. Um, I got a chance to use champions that I don't have as a five or a six star. Um, so that was pretty cool. But they have already stated that they will be doing content like that again. All right. Um, and it may be that, you know, four stars get an extra damage bonus. You know, four stars do 300% more damage. And then they have these real beefy, you know, high health pool champions you have to fight. You can do it with someone else, but it's going to be much faster and easier with your four stars. You know, they, there's a lot of things that they can do. Um, but the bottom line is, at least until you can't do it anymore, don't sell your champions. Uh, they will all be useful in some way, shape, or form in the future. All right, so that's the uh, featured and the basic three-star we don't look at because you can get the three-star as the top milestone in every single featured champion arena. Uh, and I do all three, so I get the three-star um, three times. All right. Whoa, Black Gamer number one. What? Congratulations, man. That's what's up. Okay. You went hard, didn't you? Uh, if, you if you're seeing this, I would love for you to leave a comment uh, if you want to, because I know a lot of people don't want to post up their scores, but I'm curious as to what score got you number one. We may not uh, hear from him, uh, guys, for, for that, but uh, just curious. You know, um, I'm not going to be ever going for, for that. Now, of the three here, I would say Crossbones is the best if you don't have him. Um, of course, the arena is already over, so uh, it's a done deal. But Crossbones was definitely the best of the three, in my opinion. Uh, but they all got reworks. That was the theme for this arena, reworked champions so all three got a rework but i believe crossbones had the best of the reworks and i like crossbones uh katie candy the leaderboard just got sweeter uh congratulations uh still don't know uh i, I may have to just watch uh watch your live stream uh because i'm not sure who you chose i'm so behind on on uh watching content I've been playing um, Warframe with my sister, and we just got to another level, let's just say. And so the game had be, you know, had become, you know, a little routine and everything. Karate Mike, congratulations, fellow CCP member. Um, who did you pick? Very curious. Um, but yeah, uh, <laughs> I'm curious. I'm thinking uh, it was Crossbones, the glory of man. Congratulations as well, man. Um, but yeah, I, I like Crossbones out of the three. And I was very happy to pull a Crossbones uh, from the Crystals. And at the time, he wasn't reworked. And um, people were like, okay, we know you happy. But they were just like, yeah, they wouldn't have been happy with pulling uh, crossbones, but I couldn't pull him for years and I never pulled the crossbones. They got the, uh, dual class crystals. I'm like, okay, maybe I can pull them here. And sure enough, I believe it was in the first batch of dual class crystals that I ever opened, uh, that I got crossbones. So I'm like, okay, that works for me. All right. And that is going to do it guys. So you see the score that I put up. That's about the score, 22 to 25. I didn't want to go too high because I felt that this arena, the scores were going pretty low. 
and I have already accidentally gotten a five-star champion that I wasn't going for. Um, but honestly, I'd rather have the shards than accidentally get a champion, you know, unless I was just trying to max out their SIG, but I can do that right now. Kabam has added tons of five-star SIG stones, so that's not really an issue anymore that I would need to grind out a champion to get dupe levels on them. All right, but that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And man, I got to go now make the Alliance War um, seasons, results, and opening. Hey, take care. And you all have a blessed day.